Well, back in March, we introduced you to Phantom Farm, a team of Miami Valley ghost hunters who documented their experience inside of an abandoned mental hospital, and that documentary is now streaming on Amazon Prime. They shared an update with us about a major convention that they will be attending. The cast will be taking part in the Tennessee Haunts and Legends Expo in Nashville. That's on October 21st at the Nashville Fairgrounds. Additionally, the film's videographer, Nathan Barnes, is a quarterfinalist in the Face of Horror competition. He shared these photos of his portfolio, which you can vote for. We'll have a link to check it out as well on WDTN.com. Now, if Nathan wins, he will receive a two-page spread in Rue Morgue magazine and, get this, a photo shoot with Kate Hodder. Yeah, that's the person who played Jason in the Friday the 13th movies. Fittingly, on Friday the 13th, Brooke is very courageous right now as she is sitting down with them. Prepare to be spooked. I think I drew the short straw because they knew I would be afraid. Okay, joining me now, Nathan Barnes and Tyler Terry, two local paranormal investigators and creators of the paranormal documentary Phantom Farm. Thank you so much for joining us again. We really appreciate it. And before we get into the ghost hunting, Nathan, we just mentioned that you're in that competition right now for your photography. Can you share with us a little bit about this competition and how to vote? Oh, a, little, a little help. <laughs> Uh, he says it's their second year doing it, their third or their second, their second, um, 22,000 competitors. Uh, you can vote for free or you can pay for votes, but a majority of that goes to, what's it called again? Uh, the B plus foundation, which is for pediatric cancer. Uh, you just can go to faceofhorror.org. And look for Nathan Barnes. He has a. You can follow at Tara Barn on Twitter as well, and what's oh on X? It's called X now. <laughs> You're right. Um, and yeah, you should be able to find the information there. This communication is amazing. John, John, and I do this all the time. Yeah, uh, we've been shooting for for the uh, competition, so it's hard to once he gets in it. He can't hard, get out of yeah, it. Yeah, it it's like method days. acting here. Right. Oh dear. Uh, the whole <laughs> Phantom Farm cast is headed down to Tennessee for a screening at a Haunts and Legends Expo. So how does that help you gain traction for your project? Well, I think it'll help a little, but we're really less concerned about gaining traction at this point. And th this would be the first time that we've done like an expo, like gone out and been speakers. So mm -hmm. I think it'll just be cool to actually get to interact with people. On Amazon, it kind of has mixed reviews. Um, a lot of people hate it, a lot of people love it. So it'll be cool to be there and actually, you know, get to have a conversation about what they do and don't like. And it's a very specific interest. So let's talk about ghosts and paranormal activity. It's obviously Friday the 13th. A lot of people looking to try to get into this, just like the two of you. But how can you tell if this is something that you would be interested in? How, like, how do you get into this? Well, most people that I know have, they had experiences when they were kids mm. or they lost someone and that is kind of a, a catalyst into it. But if you wanted to see if you have an interest, I would just, you don't have to dive into the deep end, but maybe go to a local historical center and I don't know, leave a donation or something because those, those people do really good work and they preserve old buildings and stuff. One of the ways they do that is through ghost tours. So. I'm sure Dayton has plenty of ghost tours and uh, ghost walks, they call them, um, where you can learn about the history of your area and if there's anything haunted there, any locations or, uh, or urban legends. And if that bores you or if it scares you too much, then it's probably not for you. <laughs> but, <me. laughs> right, so you'll, you'll probably know right away. Some people don't know. Some okay. people show up and they think they can handle it and they can't or they just absolutely, they're so bored. So, but if you like that, then if you go to somewhere like Ohio State Reformatory or we went to uh, Randolph County Infirmary for Phantom Farm and they will actually, you can pay to go on a guided investigation with paranormal investigators. They have the, the tools and stuff. You can observe them and see if, you know, their techniques and see if that's something you're into. For some people, if you're really not interested, then you'd get really, okay. you know, because they can be long and boring, but if you love the history and you love what they're doing, then that's a good way to keep the training wheels on before you 
rent a whole place to yourself and then just sleep in your van for the whole night. <laughs> well, you two are doing some very unique and creative work, very interesting work, and we're going to put it on our website if you'd like to check that all out. Nathan Barnes and Tyler Terry, two local paranormal investigators and creators of the paranormal documentary Phantom Farm. So you want to check that out if you haven't. Thank you so much for being with us, both of you. Thank you for having us.